to open the hood. There's a lever right here below your dash. Just pull forward to pop the hood. Then here in the middle of the grill, you put your fingers in the middle and push it to the right and lift up this little latch here. To check the antifreeze. This is your antifreeze coolant jug, the reservoir. This is the full line. You can see the fluid is just below that line. So you need to fill it to the full line, but not over the fuel line because it will just boil out if it's beyond this. It needs room for expansion. Once it gets hot, it'll expand. You need more pressure in the motor. So in order to top this off, you just remove this cap. Never do this hot. The engine needs to be cooled or best thing is first, first thing in the morning. This vehicle takes a Dexcool antifreeze. And I can't do this one handed so I'm going to set this down for just a moment. In most of the U.S. you can use a 50-50 water and antifreeze coolant mix. If you're in the northern areas you will need more of the antifreeze or coolant than water. If you're in southern states you might be able to get away with less coolant antifreeze and more water. I recommend you look in your owner's manual to see what the specifications are for those areas. But after you fill to the line, you can screw your cap back on. And your coolant is at a safe level and ready for your road trip.